Parkland proposals are still the subject of debates, but as Tracy Lair reports, a vote is just a few weeks away in Santa Barbara. <laughs> Parklets created during the pandemic have welcomed customers for several years now without costing businesses more than the price to build them. That might have changed this week, but the city council voted not to vote on the staff's four to ten dollars a square foot fee, depending on portability, platforms, roofs, and frontage. Mayor Randy Rouse opposes the delay, saying parklets use public right of way for free, while the city covers State Street maintenance. The blocks with the most bars and restaurants have the most parklets, but there are other blocks along State Street like this one, the 700 block, where you'll only find one or two. I think that no one should have to pay for the parklets because I think that having this as just a walking and biking street has brought in a lot more industry to Santa Barbara and a lot more tourism and good vibes, like a concert on the street. No pretendo. Council member Alejandra Gutierrez suggested an across the board $3.50 a square foot fee that appeals to bar owners. And I think every business is important to downtown. And so whether you charge a penny or a dollar, it, it shouldn't be premium to what we're paying indoors. While some businesses would rather stay silent on the issue, a Switzerland transplant thinks the parklets complement the view. At my apartment, it's very small. We don't have like a yard, so it's awesome to stay here for us. Yeah. The city will take up the issue again on May 1st. In Santa Barbara, I'm News Channel reporter Tracy Lair.